Hello everyone, I just wanted to share a couple quick thoughts about inspiration and how important it is that you have multiple streams of inspiration to help you get to where you want to go. As you probably know, your environment that you expose yourself to is what is going to make you who you end up becoming. And of course that's your physical environment, that's also like your social environment. With a lot of us nowadays we spend so much time on our devices and that is uh, another world within itself. So it's really important that you know where you go within this world. If you think of like Twitter as like another country or as like a city, where are you going on Twitter? That's what's important. Where are you going on YouTube? Where are you going on Facebook? Are you going to places, are you communicating with people that are helping you become a better version of yourself? Are they helping you become close, like getting closer to your goals? Become that person that'll help you to reach those goals, right? And it's interesting because at some points in my life, I've wanted to learn more about video game development maybe. And so I would jump into a bunch of things that were about that. And at the time, those things were great. But now, kind of focusing in other directions, it's really important that I spend less time on those things that are definitely more of a hobby and not really a interest that I want to learn more about right now. And much more into like podcasting and other things that I really am trying to make that progress in. Because at the end of the day, your time is so valuable. And honestly, <laughs> what the algorithms want is your attention. They want your time. They want all of it. They want all of your time. Like that's how you grow on YouTube. That's how you grow on a lot of things if you're able to get people to spend more time with you. And for me, I want to provide a lot of value for people. And so if they do spend a lot of time with me, I want it to be worth their while. I don't want to feel like I ripped them off or anything like that, but I want it to feel like it helped them out. I want to provide value. And that's something that I am learning to get better and better at doing. And yeah, it's important that you know what value you're, work you're looking for because then you can find it. Like with all of the search engines and stuff out there, value is a lot easier to find. Like super, super valuable content. You can find it at the click of a button. And it's because of those search engines, they're super powerful. So I would invite you to kind of look at like what you're allowing to like, you think of like a river, I guess. What what are the like the columns? What are like the aqueducts or whatever that you're letting go into your own personal reservoir of value and help? Is it stuff that's more toxic? Then you're probably going to put out more toxicity. You know, having these things in mind and continuously improving will help you to put out much more valuable content and also help you to feel a lot better too. So with that all said, I hope this was helpful for you in some way and definitely subscribe for more thoughts on becoming a better version of yourself, improving your relationship with yourself and overall just doing, having a good life. So thank you for watching. Definitely subscribe for more. I'll see you next time. Bye.